28 when I'm gardening. Guys, I'm gonna harvest my onion seeds today. So I have a massive one here. It's way in the Denagul apple tree bucket and i have another one running over there so guys i have to harvest these onion seeds and try to grow it myself because i normally order the sets of onions and i normally get like 15 sets for like 199 sometimes 2.99 at the moment guys i'm seeing them for 7.99 and upwards so i'm gonna go down and i'm gonna harvest my red onions and then I'm just going to dry off the onion seeds and then I'm going to plant my onions from seed guys, my own homegrown onions because the ones in the shop, one in the shop at the moment is super expensive. So I'm going to go around now and then start digging the onions out. So I made my way done guys and then I have to go and dig out this onion. It's been in there for more than a year now. So I know the onion is going to be having any use to you because it's bolted and everything. So you're gonna, not going to taste good. So I'm not harvesting this for eating, guys. Because all the energy went into producing the seeds. So I'm surprised the size. Ball this is not bad. But we don't want that, guys. And then my one of my beans are wrapped up around it. So I need to loose the beans. And then, so the bean is wrapped up over it, guys. So I'm just going to loose it and come back. Hold on. There it is, guys. I now have two onions with loads and loads of seeds. And I need to take these down before the thunderstorm, guys. They have come on so nicely. So I can't afford for the thunderstorm to wash all of it away. Onion flour all dry now, guys. And if you look closely, you can see the little black seeds peeping out. I've never done it before, guys, and I was so surprised that while they're drying, they just keep falling. You can just knock them like this, and they just drop out all these black seeds. Can you believe that? <laughs> I'm going to get loads and loads of onions. So I have the two that I've saved. So I can just knock them out, and the ones that don't sow, I can sow next year. But usually onion seeds, it's best to plant them as soon as they're more viable that way. So I'm going to just knock them out and then I'm going to sow them in there. Because you know with the onion sets are by, there are normally the onion that start growing. And then they pause the pro process and then we get it on and then that's why sometimes they bowl so easily. We are just in October. Today is the 5th of October. And I'm going to start my onion seeds now guys. Yes I am. And then hopefully next June, July, I should have some harvests of my own onion going on. So I'm just going to knock some more out. And then I can see all these black seeds, guys. Hey, have you ever done this, guys? I'm super excited. God, these are the nice, big, fat red onions. I like the red onions. I always say I prefer the flavor. So I'm just going to shake it out. I'm not going to do all of it and bore you guys. So you can see there's low more black seed, loads more black seeds, guys. There's loads of onion seed in both of them. This one doesn't have as much, but there's some more left in that one. So all I'm going to do now, guys, I'm going to just scoop up, I don't know, a rough estimate. There should be way more than a hundred black seeds right here. Loads and loads of black seed. And the thing is, when you buy your seeds online, as I said, the seeds don't stay viable for long. Usually by the seeds and sometimes less than half of them would germinate. These are fresh, fresh seeds. So most of these should germinate. So all I'm going to do is just get my compost right here. And it's just some random compost that I had something growing before. So nothing fancy. As I say, it's an experiment. Guys, I never grow my own onion and let it go to seed and then harvest the seed and grow it on. But with the way everything is going, guys, we have to save our own seeds. There's no doubt about it, okay? We have to save our own seeds. So I'm just going to scoop all of these up. And then I'm going to just sprinkle it on top there. And then hopefully within two weeks there about, I should have some onion popping up. And as winter is approaching, you can just cut off the top. 
add spring onions and use them while we're waiting the bulbs to develop because these will take time as you know they are just starting from scratch so you can plant them densely for now and then when they start germinate then you can thin them out so that's all i'm doing guys i'm just sprinkling all my onion seeds on top and then i'm just gonna cover them over with some dirt so that's it guys and then i'm gonna shake up the rest and store them away for next year so probably when i think about it it's probably about 200 or more because it's a lot it's a lot of seeds guys imagine that i kept buying onion and onion and onion and the last time i checked it was 50 onion sets for 9.99 so imagine that 10 pound for 50 onion sets and i have more than 200 onion seeds here and lots more to shake out so that's all guys so I'm gonna put some dirt on it now water it in and I should have loads of onions let's see put some dirt on top and it is all for the best guys let's all for the best hopefully it work and I will show you some beauties popping up in few weeks time nice onions going up in my own own onion seeds that I have so I just cover it over like that press it down slightly and these can be kept outside guys onions don't mind the cold so I'm gonna keep these away from like directly directly outside I probably just keep them in the polytunnel so that's it and then now I'm just gonna go on shake out all the rest of the onions see all the onion seeds and store these away for next year so I'll show the next update soon just after two weeks guys you can see my onions so i just saved the onion um to continue growing for the second season then let the seeds um dry off then you saw how easy i did it guys i just sprinkled everything grow up so now i'm gonna be using these as spring onion throughout winter so i'll be cutting them back as, as soon as they're big enough so this is gonna be my spring onions for winter and then as soon as spring comes, I will also plant out some more to continue growing on into big massive um, onions. But some of these will continue to grow on as well into nice fat onions. So yes guys, they have the best of both worlds. I have my spring onion for the cooler season. Then I'm going to let them stay on along with planting some more. So I can have onion bulb as well for the next growing season so that's how you grow onion from seed guys super easy this just two weeks two weeks all i did that's all i did is the seeds put the cling fling over it after these started showing appearance i took off the cling fling and that's it so thanks for watching until next time guys keep gardening take care now bye bye like share subscribe and click the notification bell